Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Miss Lachey here. So today we are jumping into color today. Okay? Today we are going to cake. No, not cake. We're gonna make up our face today. I'm so excited to be doing makeup again on my channel. I think I just went on like a hair streak and it feels so good to just sit back down and dive into my vanity and grab all my makeup accessories or products and just throw them on. Okay, so if you guys are interested in this look, I know you are, don't, don't worry. I'm a, I'm a, I spill all the beans, okay? When it comes to like makeup and tips, like I'm gonna make sure that you get everything that you need. So just continue please to keep on watching. I was sent some products by Flaws Vanity and this is the card here. It's a black owned business and if I'm not mistaken, I think they have like lash, do lashes, brows, facials, and yeah, so this is the card here. So everything that you need to know about them is here. And I'll make sure that I'll link them down below in the description bar. Um, so the first thing that they sent me was these lashes here. This is the kit. It's like a holographic kit. I think that's like hologram, hologram holographic um kit and it's their lashes in the style drippy Ooh, i'm definitely wearing these today um so here's the lashes here if you can see them so they're in a the style drippy super cute and it also comes with this um this little eyebrow brush they also sent me this lip gloss and it is in the color fairy dust and it also has their logo on the front here which i can't wait to use and it looks like a nude color so i'm definitely I'm definitely gonna try this out as well. So they did send me a small sample of their detoxifying glow mask. So they sent me a little sample here. I think I can get about two, I don't know. I'm gonna try it. Um, Grano stuff is expensive. I'm gonna go ahead and try this out. And if I like it, don't worry about it. I'm gonna be purchasing it. Um, so it did say to apply to dry skin. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that now and um, leave it on for five minutes and then just add some water to activate it. And then we can go ahead and take it off with warm water. So to be honest, you guys, that actually felt really, really good. I can definitely see myself purchasing that product just because I am in love with skincare stuff and um, just going off the way it feels, the way it smells and the way I feel after, it feels really, really this good. This is the face cream that I use. I actually got this in Greece on my honeymoon, so I don't even know if you can purchase it, um, but I'll leave it down below for you guys, at least the name so you guys can see if you can find it. You know, a lot of times they sell stuff on Amazon or, you know, you may be able to find it, but it's Spa Memories Face Cream with Hydrating Factor. To prime my face, I'm going to go ahead and use the Original Photo Finish Smooth and Blur by Smashbox. Oh, my nail. I never even knew my nail was messed up. You have to excuse me, we're in quarantine. I'll be using the Artist Couture Palette today um, by Mac Daddy. This is his Caliente Paso Mini Pretty Vivid eyeshadow colors in here. Um, this is just a, to me, it's just like a really fun palette. Anybody who wanna work with colors and anything like that. So this camera isn't really doing it justice. But Okay, so I'm gonna take my Morphe Hill JH33 brush and I'm gonna use that for this because I feel like that brush was a little too stiff. So to soften and bring that color down just a little bit, I'm gonna take this yellow here that's in the pan and I'm gonna put it right above Fuego. Okay, so now I'm going to take a skinnier kind of like stiffer brush and this is the brush from elf is the elf is their blending brush and i'm going to take mama Sita and i'll put this right in the crease
So I know I really want to use the color, what is this? Vibras. Um, so I think I'm going to try it. And if I don't, if I think it's too dark, um, I'll probably lay Brillo on top of it. So let's see. No, I actually think that's really pretty so all the colors that I put in I know it's like starting to disappear but to me I feel like it's just starting to blend the eye just a little bit um you can always go back in with the colors that you use and just layer them back up just so that you're not um the color isn't really disappearing so I'm just going to take everything that I use and, and just go back up with it Okay, so both eyes are done. I absolutely love this color payoff. Like this little palette is bringing fire. And then I wanna go ahead and apply the lashes. Like why not? I don't feel like we it's too much more to do as far as the eyes, so um, let's apply it. So I know I showed you guys here, but this is the lashes. So while my so while my eyelashes are drying, just, just a little bit, probably like 30 seconds, I'm gonna go ahead and take some of that butterscotch um, Concealer and I actually like my makeup to be or at least my foundation to be full wear and Too Faced definitely <laughs> this this concealer here is absolutely um, um Full coverage so you don't have to worry about that and I like to do it underneath my makeup also on top of my makeup And it won't look cakey trust me. These are super cute like these are like Remind me of like some type of sedity lash like real stuck up <laughs> So these are super cute. If you guys are interested in their, their products, I'll go ahead and leave that down below for you guys. So now that my lashes are on, um, I'm gonna go ahead and take my foundation and I'm gonna use it, it's in the color Chai. It's the Born This Way foundation, which is also super good if you're looking for like medium to full coverage. But for me, this, is just, this just gives me full coverage, like no in between. <laughs> the way that I use it, like I want it to be pretty much painted on. Okay, so this is the foundation. So I'm gonna actually take my butterscotch again, just a little bit. But now I'm gonna let this dry before moving it. And then I'm going to take this Super Stay um, Multi-Use Foundation Stick. I use it as a um, highlight and it's in the color Mocha, I believe. Oh, no, 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 I'm sorry. This one is in the color Deep Bronze. And it's number 370 you can get this from like target walmart it's maybelline so you know they pretty much have that everywhere and i'm just going to highlight the spots that i want to kind of show um a contour so just taking my jh05 brush by morphe i'm going to start blending in the contour So then I'm going to take my little, what is this? My sponge and I'm gonna go ahead and it's still damp and I'm gonna go ahead and help carve this out.
So just taking my brush again, I wanna get rid of all the harsh lines. And then also taking my same um, blending brush, I'm going to get rid of this contour down my nose. So now to set every, pretty much everything, I'm going to go back in with my translucent Laura Mercier um, powder. And I'm just going to push that into my skin. Yeah, this is like one of my favorite powders to use just because it's translucent and I know it looks like it's gonna come on powdery and stuff, but it actually, in reality, it really does not, doesn't. So I can actually use this all over my face just to get a matte um, look and it just pretty much disappears. So when you spray your face, it'll take away all the cakiness or it's not really cake, it's actually really, really smooth, but it'll take away all the um, powderiness. I'm gonna go in using the Morphe bronzer and it's in the color Venom. And I like to do this just to add some bronzer, some warmth over all my face. So using that same um, blending brush, I'm gonna go ahead and go in and just add the bronzer. See, as you can see, it light up. I'm not gonna leave that there, but. <laughs> So going back into my Caliente palette, I'm going to use a bullet brush. I'm gonna use this like little bullet brush and it's from BMX, I don't know where this is from, probably from Amazon. But I'm gonna go in using my, I'm gonna use Fuego, that little reddish orange color, and I'm gonna put that right underneath my lash line. Okay, so now I'm actually going to take Mama Sita and I'm going to add that one just along the side right here, just like this corner. And just by adding that, adds some more oomph to your now, I do want to take the color Brillo and I want to kind of use that as a highlight. For me, I always try to take like what's in the pan like so like this here this palette i like to use their shimmer colors and i like to use that as one of my highlights because i feel like it does just the job as a regular highlight so let me just show you here i think i'm going to use I'm gonna use Sensual and I'm going to use um, Vibras. I'm gonna just dab them both there. Okay, so I'm gonna use the plumping gloss, but I'm gonna take one of my favorite liners that I'm definitely running out of. This is the KKW in number three, I believe. And I'm just gonna line my lip. Oh, this color is cute. It's giving me like really glossy kind of look. It has some glitter in it, it looks like, but it's really cute. Like, I feel like this makes my lips look super cute. Like, plumped. And that's super cute. So let's finish off this look. I'm gonna spray my face using the Matte Magic Mist and Set by e.l.f. And I'm just going ahead and spray my whole face. Okay guys, so here we are, the final look. This is the look we achieved today. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I hope you guys are picking up new goodies today just to add to your collection. Um, Definitely check out Flawless Vanities on um, website and see what else they have to offer because I actually love these lashes and this lip gloss is real life popping. And also that detoxing um, 
glow i think it's like a glow mask or something like that i'll definitely be purchasing myself like okay thanks for the sample but i'm gonna go on there i'm gonna get the full thing you know what you was doing this caliente um palette by artist couture like he did that okay he set that palette on fire i love the vivid colors i like the playful look that i created with this um and yeah pretty much everything that i use today you guys i feel like is a necessity um so anything you choose from would be good to add to your collection and yeah i think that's pretty much all i have you guys don't forget to turn your post notifications on i want to go ahead and do more makeup looks for you guys because i just enjoy makeup just as much as i do hair and hair has been tripping lately <sighs> having me going on one but i'm ready to bring back some makeup looks for you guys and any questions you guys may have go ahead and leave a comment i reply to you guys i'm here to respond so i just want to know what you guys are interested in so i can constantly bring that to you but other than that like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in a later video bye